Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to obtain the bulletproof, fireproof, explosion proof, melee proof, and an exclusive color to secondary, invisible, exclusive color, dark scarlet fortune. This is the other race vehicle that you can obtain, and it's going to, it's much later on than the elegy because you needed a homie, and now I have the ability because I came back to Los Santos. We're going to continue through the race. We're not going to pass it, though. Um, at a certain point, we're going to abandon the whole race. And we will find one of the Grove Street members. Which means I advise you to take over some territory in Los Santos. Probably close to, like, Santa Maria Beach. Those areas, because they're quite not far from your, the race, so you can just drive there, pick up a Grove Street member, and then come back to the other races at the finish line. This upcoming marker, the checkpoint of the race, is the final one you're going to pick up. At this point, let's go to... Los Santos, we're going to go pick up a Grove Street member. Alright, so I've taken over some territory right here at Santa Maria Beach, so it won't be a problem, hopefully. As long as they spawn, it won't be a big problem. At least I don't have to travel further from here. So... As long as they spawn, I'm good. Oh, there they are. Okay, I found some guys. I actually think you could actually hire um, the people in the vehicles too. Like, Grove Street members do drive vehicles. And primarily, like, the Voodoo. And I've seen that. So I could have actually hired them, I think. But it's fine. I've got my dude, dude with me. And we're going to go back this time at the finish line. Because we're going to wait for the other races to actually come in first place or second, third. They're going to beat you to it. So it's inevitable loss for you. It's fine. We're not after the win. We're after the for this fortune. There's one of the vehicles. Yeah, it's the Stallion. Not the Fortune I'm after, but they'll come shortly after. And there's the other. And the Fortune. Oh, this Stallion's in the way. Yeah, especially if the Fortune comes last. It, you can have some of vehicles in the way. So you got this 25 second timer. Before it runs out... Oh. Gosh, yeah, this, I just got to move the stallion out of the way first. Now we can get started. I will use free aim for this task. Continuously attempt to enter. Grove Street member can. Ah, and you have to headshot him. So he leaves the door open. And be mindful of this. 25 second timer. Alright, there we go. So the door's left open. That's nice. Alright, there we go. Now, let's get Woozy out. There we go, nice. 
You can choose to kill him or not. Your choice. It won't do anything terrible about the race. Um, won't disqualify you. Anyways, the next task is to finally obtain this vehicle. Take it to a garage. And you could either go to Dillamore or Palomino Creek. Palomino Creek is actually further. But it, obviously, if you're in the making of a... Uh, save file, you most likely have the old proof saber and saddler in there or any other vehicle so what I've done I've emptied mine just to sh just to make it easier I chose to yeah take a shorter distance in getting to a garage but it it's still doable to go to Palomino Creek just know that it is possible just be mindful you don't want to destroy the saber because you know so kind of be gentle with this yeah I'm at Dillamore I gotta push it in it won't properly be stored though so once you're done with this make sure to open and close the garage so the game actually knows that you have successfully stored it and it and you can keep it Destroy the saber once it's in. You'll be teleported back to the race tournament. We have to go all the way back. Check it's in the garage. It will be. You need to open and close. Then the game knows that it's stored inside. Then you can save. Right. So we're going to check out this vehicle. And it's pretty much the last side mission vehicle. That I'm going to cover now. There we go. It's properly stored. And plus. It has a locked door pretty much. Anyway. So you had to properly. Restore it in the garage. And then. So the game knows that it's stored. And yeah the doors. Explosion proof property. Yes it is explosion proof. Okay, I'll hide in here, away from the police. So, what about bulletproof? Yes, it exists. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I've already tested the explosion proof, but... There we go. Anyways, I will test out more the fireproof and melee proof. I still don't have the parachute. Would you believe it? Gosh. Okay. Anyways. Let's just park this right here. And it will ca cause a blaze. Like usual. Helps me test the fireproof property. More police, but it's fine. I'm sure I can get away with this. Alright, put it in the flame. No? Nothing? Awesome, okay. So it is fireproof, that is awesome to see. And pretty much the only property left to um, show is melee proof. The secondary exclusive color, I cannot show, it's invisible. Anyways, melee proof property, the best I can do is just kick it until nothing happens really. Just do it for a long time. Alright, so I think I can pretty much confirm that it's melee proof. Alright. So yeah, that is the bulletproof, fireproof, explosion proof, melee proof, exclusive color 2, dark scarlet fortune. Another race vehicle. There are inferior fireproof vehicles that are from races. I'm not going to cover them. They're just inferior, to be honest. It 
and there's a handful of them. So, I don't think I should cover those. Let me know. So, should I? It's up to you, I guess. Anyways, that is the end of the video. That's it. See ya.